Hello, I am Lux Brush, and welcome to my quick thoughts on Season 4, Episode 4 of My Little Pony Friendship is Magic, Daring Don't. I thought it was a pretty good episode overall, a lot of fun stuff, I like how we get to see Daring Do again, I love how we get to see how much of a fangirl Rainbow Dash actually is, and kind of an interesting nod to the Harry Potter series with the play on the J.K. Rowling name. I had a feeling we would go for the author actually being the character. Kind of fits in the MLP world, you know, with all the magic, fantasy, fiction, world stuff actually working there. So, of course, that Daring Do would actually be a real person in that world. You could go with one of two routes on a Daring Do episode. Either we'd find out she's an old person who's very creative and is very meek, or a young person who's very meek, or we'd go with, yeah, she's actually Daring Do. It wasn't that obvious until you actually got to see Daring Do. When we first saw the house, I actually thought that she was doing that to make it so no one wants to disturb her, and she was going to be suffering from Briar's Block. But we go on a crazy adventure instead, and that's pretty nice. I think they almost made Rainbow Dash a little too fangirly. Oh, going back to the beginning real quick, I find it kind of interesting that they didn't help her sooner. I mean, they've saved Equestria how many times? These main six ponies? So why didn't they jump in sooner? Though I can see the joke set up, so Fluttershy gets to go, um, shouldn't we, uh, help? Yeah, so we get that. The resolution in the end felt a bit rushed, but it works, and we get to see Rainbow Dash and Daring Do work together. I had a feeling we would see Rainbow Dash on the cover of the book. I thought we might actually get an excerpt from it describing the tales of Daring Do interacting with all the other ponies as well as Rainbow Dash. The animation was nice. The part at the temple when they finally took off the final ring kind of made me start thinking stuff like, well, if it dissolves once you take off the ring, does that mean that before when the ring wasn't there that this thing actually wasn't there? So if it wasn't actually there, how would you know to... Or did the thing construct itself when you put the ring down? Or was that bottom ring always there? There's still answers to that. I just found it kind of funny that my brain went there as I was watching the episode. Overall, it was good. Did a lot of neat things. I like going back to Daring Do because she was one of my favorite side stories slash characters. Thank you for listening slash watching, and I hope to do more videos soon. This has been my quick thoughts on Season 4, Episode 4, Daring Don't of My Little Pony, Friendship is Magic. Okay, some updates. Those videos I said I would be getting out last week, sorry I didn't get those out. The room where I usually do my recording has been a lot colder because of the weather down here. It's been somewhere around the low 20s, so yeah. I just managed to find an alternative place in my house to do recording for this new episode. I'm going to try to get those other videos out as soon as I can, and get that other quick thought I had about Nintendo out. Also, I was thinking of maybe doing some quick thoughts on the Stanley Parable. That will probably be heavily spoiler-filled, so if you don't want to know anything about that game and go in cold, you might not want to listen to it. But listen to it anyways, after you're done playing the game. Talk to you all later. Bye!